Hi, this is the shortest version of the presentation for From Pilot to Jetstream, Building Training Pathways and Collaboration in Data Science and Digital Humanities through the Library. It's about the Graduate Specialist Program at Rutgers New Brunswick Libraries. I'm Brian Womack. I'm Data Librarian at Rutgers University New Brunswick. I'm acknowledging the work of Dee Magnoni in supporting this project and contributing some of the slides. Dee is our Associate University Librarian for Rutgers New Brunswick. So let's talk about the background. Uh, this is just the five minute version of this presentation, so I'll whip through things. And since 2010, I have been involved with R instruction, uh, experiencing a demand for more types of things, including lots of Python. We also have a digital humanities librarian, Francesca Gianetti, since 2014, who has a lot of experience giving workshops. We went through a process uh, for a grant proposal called the Data Science Concierge Project that fleshed out a lot of these ideas, but th that was unsuccessful. However, we came back in spring 2018 to pilot a program with two graduate student hires, one for quantitative data and one for digital humanities. Now, I'll just point out along the way that this uh, program hits many of our strategic plan themes for student success, faculty, research, uh, augmenting physical and virtual spaces. And so our director, Dee Magnoni, supported this program uh, as a pilot. Uh, we, we wanted to build a program that had skill building opportunities for our graduate specialists. We called them graduate specialists because that is a special term that doesn't conflict with other titles around the system. We didn't have the opportunity to have any full-time staff support like other universities, uh, but we did uh, argue for a higher wage rate for these positions than other library positions. During that first pilot, we set up uh, physical spaces and virtual spaces. The links are there. Um, we expanded over time gradually. We had great feedback and we were able to continue the program. We went from two specialists to four specialists, then five specialists, including qualitative GIS and a second data specialist. We we're being asked for more workshops, more webinars, but we didn't actually get around to delivering webinars until COVID forced our hand. Here's a quick slide of our uh, cohort of graduate specialists in 2020, our great group of graduate specialists. Um, here's a word cloud of topics that were covered uh, in spring 2020 to give you a sense of what's going on there. Um, this is a snapshot of workshops uh, delivered for Python to show you the range of departments that we interact with. Uh, also along the way, we wanted to build a collaborative space. And we uh, had been teaching in very traditional classrooms, but we got a new space renovated, which we call the Jetstream, because it is on the top floor of the library and there's high-speed ideas floating around up there. Uh, it's a very configurable room that we want to build into a collaborative space. And this was really made possible, I think, by the thinking behind the Graduate Specialist Program. So in 2021, of course, we have the year of COVID, um, but we were able, thanks to our Graduate Specialists, to move everything online. And we had an enormous surge of interest in fall 2020 with very large numbers for our workshops, 566 Python registrants in the fall. Uh, that diminished by the spring because people probably had filled their calendars and had some Zoom fatigue, but we managed to, to have a great outreach. Um, and we also had a better calendar system, which I provided links to, to help bring people in and register them. This program led directly to collaborations with the Office of Advanced Research Computing to cross-list workshops with them, and also we, we developed some high performance computing themed workshops um, that introduced users to their resources. Uh, we also were able to provide support with our graduate specialists to a program called the Erdos Institute, which provides an online data bootcamp for PhDs. Uh, they're actually in session right now, um, working on machine learning with Python, uh, which we wouldn't have been able to do, make the contacts without our efforts for this program. And this academic year, we have two other spin-offs uh, around the idea of having graduate specialists 
uh, graduate student workers supervised by the libraries, one in design thinking and one in intensive literature review. These are supervised by the libraries, but they're paid for by the external academic departments. And that's really a first for us. Um, we haven't had that kind of activity before. So this has had a, a lot of beneficial feedback effects. We've uh, built up an online archive of learning materials and videos. We have worked with many spaces and we've transformed our budget model to some extent. So that's the encapsulated version. I'll give you links to the longer versions. If you want more details, please feel free to contact me and thank you for your attention. Спасибо, Машик, Байтла. Um, merci. Çok teşekkür ederiz.